Good afternoon, everyone. So I had the bright idea that I wanted like some tea, but I didn't feel like going out to Starbucks. So I was like, I have a really nice 32 ounce cup and I'm about to use the ingredients that I have at home to make me my own iced tea. So as you all can see, I got some lemon juice, some raspberry um, zinger tea, and it's great hot or iced. And I'm just showing the tea bags that come in each box. I got some lemon and ginger tea by the Twinings brand. And there's what that looks like out of the box. And then lastly, I have some Tea Havana Peach Tranquility Tea. All three of these teas are caffeine free, but this is what that tea, um, you know, little packet looks like inside of the box. And I'm also going to use some sugar. And uh, here I am just boiling some water, um, you know, for my tea. As you all can see, I'm just gonna go ahead and drop um, the tea bags into the water. There's my raspberry one, here's my lemon and ginger one. Just gonna try to tuck this little tag under the eye cover so it doesn't touch the fire. Uh oh, well, that first attempt failed. <laughs> All right, we're gonna try this again. There we go. And there's my peach tea bag. That tag's a little shorter, so it should be good just to hang. So for a brief moment, I'm just admiring how beautiful that tea color is. It's just so pretty and so red. Yes, and it smells really good too. So now I've reached the point where my tea um, is done boiling. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, remove the tea bags because the tea has, you know, steeped or whatever for like over 15 minutes. And so you all can just see me placing the tea bags onto a paper towel so that I can, you know, throw those in the trash. And here I am now, and it's about to be an epic fail. I'm just warning you guys. I tried with one hand to pour the hot tea into my uh, cup of ice. As you all can see, it was a big mess. So here I am just cleaning up my mess. I'm just, you know, using a paper towel to clean it up right now. I will go behind myself and use some actual cleaner to clean this up here. And now I'm just adding a little cane sugar to my tea. Um, as you all can see, the sugar is just, mm, it's just bathing in that nice warm tea. And now I'm adding just a splash of lemon juice for flavor. Look at that. And now I'm just going to blend up my sugar and lemon juice. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the tea totally melted all my pieces of ice that were in the tea. But that hot cold balance kind of left my tea is like a slightly cool tea. It wasn't warm by the time I started drinking it. So it kind of actually worked out. But yep, as you all can see, I'm just continuing to blend all the pieces of sugar throughout the tea. So again, I'm just admiring the beauty of this tea. It's such a pretty color and it just really puts me in the mind of something that I would maybe typically get, you know, from Starbucks as far as like the look of it. It's just not in a Starbucks cup. So again, here's just another view of my tea. 
and it's been sitting for you know a little while you know so that all the flavors can you know just combine themselves so yeah if you guys want to try this tea at home of course i've shown all the ingredients and so i would say go for it save yourself some money and do something different so i've been drinking a little of the tea and i just wanted to come on camera and do like the taste test on camera even though i've been drinking some of it but the tea turned out really good so i would definitely recommend you all trying this recipe it definitely hit that urge for me to have like some iced tea from starbucks and of course like i said i'm just enjoying it from home so sometimes it's about using what you have in your house all right peace <laughs>